welcome to another episode of Carbs here on Reckless Eating. You know, show us in the car and BS while consuming carbs. Matt Zion here. We're doing a very weird item of a first for the channel. This is the Chuck E. Cheese spaghetti and meatballs pizza. What? What? <laughs> what? Why is this a thing? Uh, because if you don't know, Chuck E. Cheese is where you take your kids and they can play like arcade games and there's some animatronic like mouse and stuff that sing. It's very, very strange. I gotta say this looks terrible. Uh, here is a picture of what mine actually looks like. It does not look particularly appealing. So the, <laughs> the noodles don't look particularly cooked all that well. Uh, the meatballs look okay, but it just look, it looks like it has been sitting out for like a day and now I'm getting to eat it. Oh God, uh, I got this the personal pizza one because that was the cheapest. I think this was around uh, about $8 for it. Uh, I got one piece here, it has just everything on it. Uh, this just doesn't, this doesn't look appealing. The noodles up at the top don't even look cooked at all. Uh, okay, here we go, let's try out. The meatballs are really good. They're very, very good. The sauce is okay, but those noodles, there is some definite problem. Texture wise, not good. And they just, again, they don't, they don't taste like they're fully cooked all the way. Oh yeah, no. Oh God, noodles up at the top are definitely not cooked all the way. The meatballs are really good. I mean, like that's easily the best part of it. But when your noodles just aren't cooking right, obviously that's gonna be a big issue. I know Chuck E. Cheese is not known for their food. I mean, nobody goes there thinking, I'm gonna get Chuck E. Cheese food, yay! Because it's, it's just there to satisfy, you know, the need of children. They sell alcohol there to satisfy the parents to keep them sane. But other than the meatballs, this is terrible. I mean, this is like borderline one of the worst pizzas I think I've ever had. It's hard to screw up pizza, but this isn't, I guess this just really isn't pizza. Like, this feels like something Chris would just make on his, at his own time, at his own leisure. I would rate this a incredibly, incredibly low two. This, this is the absolute desperation of drunk food right here. I'm so drunk that I just don't care and I just need food and I would eat it. But these, this, the noodles are just, they're awful. They're just, they're just abysmal. Avoid this and if, you, if you're at Chuck E. Cheese for whatever reason, just get a regular slice of pizza or something. They also had like buffalo wings. There's a lot better stuff there, but I, maybe it's bad of me to, to be so harsh on Chuck E. Cheese because, I mean, who cares about Chuck E. Cheese at this point? But this is absolutely terrible. <laughs> Avoid this product at all costs. The spaghetti meatballs pizza at Chuck E. Cheese, no one was asking for it, but they did it anyway. Okay, <laughs> that's it. That's it. I'd say we'll see you on the next episode.